She took right to her. Doberman adopts Tiny Kitten and nurses her back to health. Ruby, a sweet Doberman from New York, was so prepared to be a mom that she decided to go ahead and adopt a cat, too. Brittany Callen, the dog's owner, lives on a farm where they breed Dobermans. They first got Ruby when she was only eight weeks old, and from the start, she's proven to be a compassionate, loving pup. Ruby grew up with small animals and learned to be nice and just lick them and be friendly with everything, Brittany said. She's just an extremely, extremely compassionate dog. Brittany's no different. As she was helping clean her aunt's gutters one day, she heard meowing noises that seemed to be coming from behind the garage. Of course, me being an animal lover, I had to go check it out, she said. Thankfully, she was able to find the poor kitten who, at only a few days old, had been abandoned. They could tell because part of a dried umbilical cord was still attached to her. Brittany and her cousin, Nicole Gibbs, waited around the area in hopes that the kitten's mother would come back for her baby. Once it became clear that that wasn't likely to happen, they decided to name the cat Ramblin' Rose in honor of Nicole's late father's favorite song. Since Ramblin' Rose was so young, she needed to be fed milk ASAP to have a chance at survival. Fortunately, Ruby had just given birth to her litter of eight puppies a week before. That meant that her own pups had yet to open their eyes and were still nursing. With such perfect timing, Brittany had to at least try to introduce the kitten to Ruby. If all went well, the dog would feed her too. Instantly, Ruby accepted the kitten as one of her own. She took right to her and didn't seem to mind at all, Brittany said. Ruby's kindness toward Ramblin' Rose didn't end there. Since adopting the tiny feline, Ruby has taken note of the little kitten's needs and has acted accordingly. For example, Ruby's puppies can sometimes be far too rowdy for the shy kitty. Rather than ignoring Ramblin' Rose, Ruby will move her from the pen take her over to the couch and lie down beside her. Despite their different personalities, even the puppies have come to treat Ramble and Rose like family. At night, all 10 of them can be found snuggling up together sleeping. Once the puppies turn 10 weeks old, they'll move into their new forever homes. As for Ruby and Ramble and Rose, there's no doubt they'll be staying in each other's lives. Nicole will be adopting the adorable kitten once Ramble and Rose is done nursing. Since she lives so close to Brittany, you can bet there will be plenty of visits. I can take Ruby over to see her anytime, Nicole said. What a powerful reminder that motherhood knows no bounds. Don't forget to share this moving story with a friend. <laughs>